The Slender Man. <laughs> HD here, and uh, today I am showing you guys how to install Spark IV, the EFLC in the normal GTA version. And um, so, what you have to do is go on your internet browser, doesn't matter, it could be Mozilla, Google Internet Explorer, whatever you want. Get on Google and type in Spark IV 0.6.6, like this one here. So, you click this and you can go get a link and the top one will say GTA inside and blah 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 you click this it should be for IV and EFLC so you see this right here all you gotta do is go down to download start download and you could save or open it really doesn't matter and make sure you have it with run raw um, so once it's opened what you wanna do is create a folder like this it should say spark IV EFLC and it should look just like this all caps and what you want to do is you don't take any of these files you open up the second WinRAW fire file the EFLC one and you copy or you just uh, drag and drop everything into this folder now I'm not gonna do that because it's gonna replace all my files that I have in here but all you have to do is just put the drag these onto the folder on your desktop and you should get something you see this application spark iv if you look in here it says spark iv you just have to run this as an administrator if you don't run it as administrator it won't always work so you run as administrator and then you hit browse so now if you want to install a car on I, I don't know what car to install just find one real quick uh, give me a name this right here this Ford Mustang so what you do download and start download save file and you go to where it's downloaded open it and uh, what you do is you take these two files the WTD and the WFT and you just throw them on your desktop and if you want to change where it goes, you just highlight it like this, hit rename, or rename, and like, I just want it to be the Viagro, or whatever. So now, when it's on your desktop, you scroll down, past all these a bunch of links, or whatever they are, and hit go to CDI images. Once you hit this, you're going to see vehicles, weapons, all this. You open up vehicles, double tap it, and now you're going to see all the GTA vehicles. What you want to do is import and then you want to highlight over your two cars hit open and if you want to check you can scroll all the way down to where you got it it'll be blue then you hit rebuild and then save and that's about it uh... this is how to install a car i hope you guys enjoyed uh... i'll see you guys later don't forget to subscribe comment like whatever i'm out peace <laughs>